Today is May 15th. May 15th, 2020. May 15th. What are we talking about? Let's well, just a couple things. CNN has to vote on $3 trillion COVID aid package and historic rules change to allow remote voting. Prestigious medical journal blasts Trump part of New York to open. CDC publishes short reopening guidance. Preliminary 6.4 magnitude earthquake in western Nevada. Fell from Utah to California. Ivanka Trump wears a mask at the White House as the president continues public appearances without one. Their angry pandemic and economic collapse slammed Trump across the rust belt. House Speaker Pelosi holds weekly news conference. So, yeah, Anna DeVar returns. Meghan McCain out again. Fans react. Former White House physician Ronnie Jackson dives headfirst into Obamagate. Angers former colleagues. Cooper claps back at Trump Jr. Jr. over Thunberg drama. Barton pledges not to pardon Trump. Five police officers, seven detention center employees in Texas are in quarantine after arrest of a suspect with coronavirus. Kentucky AG asked to serve as special prosecutor in the Breonna Taylor case. I believe he's a black man, the Kentucky Attorney General. Mitch McConnell says he was wrong to say Obama left behind no pandemic plan. Ha! Huh. Mitch McConnell's wrong. So that just gives you an idea. It's 9.01 a.m. May 15th, 2020. I just want to talk about some of the historical events that have happened in the past. If you don't know your roots, what kind of tree is going to grow without good, solid roots? you got to have strong roots. you got to have strong wings. you got to have a strong idea of the past and the future. And also, you got to, you know, work on being in the present moment, too. So, a lot of things happened actually on May 15th, 1905. Abraham Zapruder was born in Ukraine, 1972. George Wallace is going to be shot and paralyzed by Arthur Bremer, 1972. Winnipeg general strike begins. This is 1919. They were dealing with the pandemic during then, the Spanish flu. And that's the Red Scare. 1919 was a terrible year for everybody, including America. So the Winnipeg general strike begins May 15th, 1919. George Wallace shot May 15th, 1972. California becomes the second state in America to legalize gay marriage. This is 12 years ago. So this is a relatively brand new phenomenon. California was the second state. Supreme Court said that one of their things, they overturned it, and then within a month they're issuing gay marriage licenses. 1940. The first McDonald's from the actual McDonald's brothers, not that Ray Kroc crook, but the actual honest, decent, good, hard-working McDonald's brothers. They opened up their first McDonald's, 1940, May 15th. May 15th, 1911, SCOTUS rules that Standard Oil is a monopoly in violation of the Sherman Antitrust Act, and therefore Standard Oil needs to break up. So trust busters breaking up those big ass monopolies. It's all based on a Scotus ruling. 1618, Johann Kepler confirms the third law of planetary motion. The third law of planetary motion. The first law is the orbit of a planet is an ellipse with the sun at one of the two foci, a line segment joining a planet. And the sun sweeps out equal areas during equal intervals of time. And then the square of the orbital period of a planet is directly proportional to the cube of the semi-major axis of its orbit. So that's the third law of planetary motion. Johann Kepler, come up with it, May 15th, 1618. Mickey Mouse is going to debut in Playing Crazy, May 15th, 1928. Seventeen eighteen, James Puckle patents a first machine gun. Nineteen fifteen, Paul Samuelson, the economist, is born. Nineteen thirty six, Ralph Stedman is born. Lithuania Constituent Assembly Day, Republic Day, for the country of Lithuania. They actually have a holiday today where they celebrate the Constituent Assembly Day. And last but not least. 
You're going to have a major deposing Emperor Valentinian of uh, the second Emperor Valentinian the second. He ruled for 17 years. He's an emperor of the Roman Empire for 17 years. They're going to find him hung in his own home in Vienne, Gaul by Arbogast, a Frankish king. Uh, a couple other things, 1960-1958, Sputnik 3 and 4. Abraham Lincoln creates the United States Department of Agriculture, 1862. Jessica Watson, the youngest person to sail around the world, 2010.